Hey guys, welcome back. If you're new here, welcome to my channel. So for today's video, we're doing some lip swatches. It's just a nice quick one for you guys. I just wanted to swatch and review the Huda Beauty Lip Strobes. This is my PR package. I got this a really long time ago now, like months ago, and I have just been the slackest YouTuber in the entire world, and I have not got around to using them or swatching them or anything for you guys. So I'm sorry that I suck. Essentially, these are just glosses. So I'll pull one out and show you guys. The packaging is pretty standard to their regular matte liquid lipstick, which I have one here to compare to you guys. Basically the same packaging, except the matte liquid lipsticks are in a frosted bottle to indicate that they're matte. And these ones are just in regular plastic sort of packaging. I'm actually wearing the shade Trendsetter in her regular matte liquid lipsticks at the moment with the shade Foxy in the lip strobes on top if you guys are curious about my lip combo. Um, and then as for my eye makeup, I actually filmed a tutorial for you guys so I will leave that linked down below if you want to check it out and see how I created this look. So I believe there are 12 shades in total. I'm not sure if they've come out with any more since the original launch. In terms of the formula, they are not sticky which I was very very impressed with. I don't like lip gloss. I'll tell you guys straight now. I do not like it. I'll put it on, but I usually blot it and just sort of massage it into my lips as more of like a lip balm than a lip gloss. I'm someone who licks my lips and I don't want something sticky going in there. It's just kind of gross. At least with a matte lipstick, it can kind of just crumble off and wear off throughout the day. Um, but yeah, I actually like the formula. They're not goopy. They're not thick. They're not sticky. They're quite thin. Um, the darker shades are a lot more pigmented than the lighter shades. So the darker shades you could definitely wear on their own. Like this one, for instance, was very pigmented, really beautiful and stunning. This would be a really lovely like Christmas sort of shade, especially if you're not planning on wearing like a really heavy eye and you just want like that statement sort of lip. That's what these are really great for. And then the lighter shades, they can be used as like lip toppers. They're not going to be something that I reach for all the time, but if I'm ever looking for something for a tutorial where I'm like, I just need like that extra oomph for like a festival look or just like a really pretty glam kind of look, then these are what I'll go for. These would be really cool as well to do that really nice glossy lid that everyone's super into at the moment, just because they have such a cool shift. As you guys will see with the swatches, some of them are like crazy cool duochrome sort of shades. So that's basically it. I just wanted to let you guys know what I thought quickly rather than do like a full review, because um, I do want this video just focused on the lip swatches for anyone who wants to purchase any of the colors or if you just like watching lip swatch videos. Um, so yeah, if you want to see the swatches, then definitely stay tuned and keep watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy lip swatch videos. And let me know your favorite color down below. And don't forget to subscribe. Join the fam, because I would love to have you. Um, and yeah, I will see you guys in my next video.